Yo, what's going on you guys? It is your boy, your main man, your main black man, Tavius, and we're finally here with the video. And as you can see here, today we are on the Guilty Gear Strive Beta. Today is the 21st that I'm recording this. The day that the beta was supposed to end It's going to be extended to the 23rd. If you guys enjoyed this video, I'm going to be playing some Kai today. I'm going to be doing some ranked matches currently in Tower. Like the video or subscribe if you guys are up for that and you want to see more content on this game and more content on fighting games in general. Also, check out my Twitch. It's going to be in the description and in the comments. We get active out there. So, yeah, appreciate it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And, uh, yeah, let's get on to the matches. All right. Now, after con consistently failing to connect with people, I'm finally in a game. My first match is going to be against Amelia. I've only fought Amelia one time, but it was not a good thing. As you can see, I am currently a level 40. So oh, it, it went away. I'm a level 47 with the Kai. So we're going to see what's happening. Um, I don't have a... <laughs> this character's wild. That's all I'm saying. So let's see how, let's see how it goes. Zero, ro one rollback frame, two rollback frames. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Oh, I tried to DP. That's interesting. I was waiting for him to, for for Milia to jump. Milia seems like her best thing is to uh oh. Best thing is to jump, it seems like. I don't really know what this character does Be because she's like she's not that great in the in this version of the game. And it's like because she's not great, she kind of is forced to play like wild. Like she like Emilia in this game, she's forced to uh, she's forced to play aggressive because I guess like the little the little projectile she had in Xer, like the pin, the little pin thing. They didn't they didn't they took out in this game, so she doesn't have that anymore. Yes, dead. You're not dead? There we go. Jesus Christ, he was literally left with a pixel of health. Conne but yeah, so far from my experience, connection's great. Um, right now, um, like, I got a, I got a new, yeah, oh shoot, hold on. I got new internet, so I had to get like a new cable, right? So I was playing wa oh, on Wi-Fi for a bit, uh, from coast to coast. Pretty good, pretty good connection. I don't think I'm I'm winning because I don't know what this character does. But the the, the general gist of, of Milia it seems like all like they're gonna jump. It's gonna happen. Yeah, that, that's the bummer about, like, you know, playing against, uh, you know, a completely new game. Because me, personally, I never, like, this is, like, my first GG. Because I never, I like, I played X, I played Accent Core Plus R and I played Xrd. But none of them have been, like, I where I played them seriously to the point where I know what's going on. So this is technically my first Guilty Gear. But, you know, this is the game. The beta is the time to be trash. Basically, is what I'm saying. The beta is the time to be good, to be bad at the game and not know what's going on. So we need to, we need to take some dubs for the for the video. That would definitely be nice. Um, let's get to the next game, though. All right. Finally. Jeez. That, yo, that first game, that first game against Amelia, that junk was like, that junk was like six or seven minutes ago. Uh, I've been sitting here waiting for about that much time. Current, like, connecting, disconnecting from people. Like failing to load, but we're finally in a game, and it's a Kai mirror match. So this is gonna be interesting. They blame the Nick. All right, what what do we got? What you got for me in terms of dialogue? The sword is the sword is not like. I believe I understand that better than you. Something about this the sword is not like kicks. All right, we round start slash. Oh, 
Oh shoot, I don't know why I did DP there. Oh wow, for real? What did I even get hit with? Was that 214K? interesting that's unfortunate that is so unfortunate man neutral in this game is so weird especially when you're playing two of the char two characters that are the same it's it's like I'm just it's like you're trying to get in but you just can't you're trying to play neutral but then some random stuff just happens. Maybe that uh, I'm pretty sure that's just a guilty gear thing in general, but it's it's very weird the way that this game is approached when it comes to neutral. Neutral is very awkward in this game. From my first from my first impressions, like not really playing any guilty gear game uh like prior, like seriously played, but I guess it, it is what it is. Um, I'll, I'll try to get used to it. All right, so I found this Mudkip person again, the person that I just got done playing against. So let's see how let's see how it goes this time. Basically, gonna just look look out for two one four K randomly coming out in neutral, and the slide move, which I don't really use that often because I'm trying to play neutral neutral, but I guess I'm playing the wrong game for that. Oh, wow. Oh, that DP was uncalled for. Bro, I'm plus there. What the freak? I didn't even do that. Oohs. I caught him caught him throwing a fireball out. <laughs> know the smell of the game, son of a bit. Oh my god, I don't know why I keep DPing. Jesus Christ. Dragon install, baby. Oh. Oh, my God. What happened? What happened? What did I get hit by? Mirror, the kind mirror matches. It's something for sure. Oh wow, he just randomly pressed the button there. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna constantly press, unfortunately. I think that was yeah, that was me. It seems like 
another thing that's kind of kind of annoying about this game i know i'm probably just going to be pointing out all the, the it's probably annoying at this point in this video but counter hit happens so often in this game and i hope tone it down to a certain degree because it seems like the majority of the time you're constantly getting hit by just random stray hits in neutral and then on the the freaking announcer counter it's kind of tedious and it makes playing neutral kind of kind of whack and it makes you not want to try to counter poke because you don't know what button you're going to randomly get hit by unfortunately.